Hi everybody, I wanted to show you today how to make soft scrambled eggs and uh, this is different than what you've probably seen anywhere else. Um, I looked on the internet to see if I should even bother making this because it's such a common thing, but I learned how to do this from uh, my dad. I, I made scrambled eggs for years, my wife made scrambled eggs for years, but we can never get them to be soft uh, like I like them. And whenever I'd visit my dad, his were always great. So I finally I watched him one day to figure out what he was doing and um, it, it kind of amazed me. Um, and it makes so much sense. I've got four eggs here and they are in uh, uh, warm water, not hot, because uh, I learned that the eggs, when you crack them, the, the egg comes out easier when it's warm. You don't have that um, the egg white kind of hanging on to the, to the eggshells. They just sort of slide out. So one of the messages I'm trying to get across here is to, is to keep the mess down. And this method does that. So I'm going to go ahead and crack the first one. I've got a, a pat of butter in the skillet, and um, it's warm. I've got the skillet warm. And so you want to get it to that stage, and then uh, you crack your eggs. And what you notice is that uh, I'm not putting these in a dish. Whoops, got one little egg there, eggshell out. So let me get that out. And uh, let me put this over here. And. Uh, they just sort of slide out. So do egg number two. We're doing four eggs today. These are jumbos, but you can do it with any egg. And it's best to have a good uh, flexible spatula um, the uh, hang on one second the, <clears throat> the uh, egg yolk here is uh, you want to go ahead and break that now and you've got this on low to medium heat you can turn it up a little bit now and you do your uh, scrambling in the skillet and that is the secret that's how you make really soft scrambled eggs. You know, I would go on trips and business and stop at restaurants and they'd have the buffet out there and you could get a, a spoonful of eggs and uh, it would sit there on the spoon like a, like a tennis ball, just, you know, firm. And uh, I, I never really liked that. And uh, what I like is soft scrambled eggs and that's what we're making here. And you just go around real slowly with this. And you'll see at the end, turning the heat up a little bit. And this flexible spatula really helps in this nonstick skillet to keep these things moving around and soft. And if you think about it, what is the point really in getting a whisk and whisking the heck out of your scrambled eggs in a Pyrex dish or a bowl or whatever? Um, because you're scrambling them in the skillet and you have one less dish that's full of wasted egg that's clinging into the sides. Um, and you've got another dish, big one usually, because you put say three or four eggs in it or more. And you can see how this is starting to firm up it's got a beautiful color. You still see the yellow. You see a little bit of the white. And you can see how soft they are. Okay, now I'm, I'm going to turn these. That's the other thing you can do. Because you don't want them to overcook. You just want them to be nice and soft and done. And just keep moving them around. We're almost there.
So as you can tell, these, these eggs are cooked through. Now what I'm going to do, I'm going to show you another little trick here that I really like. So these are still cooking. I'm going to set them to the side, see, so they stay warm and they're really still cooking. I'm going to turn this off, turn the burner off, and then this is a Corel plate. It's a brand new set we just got. And you put your plate right there on the burner, put your hand here, and just wait a few seconds. That way you're not putting your wonderful warm eggs on a cold plate. So that's hot. When it gets uncomfortable for your hand, that's your sign. So you go ahead and get this and you are ready to plate your wonderfully soft scrambled eggs. And that is gorgeous. Okay, so that's it. That's how you do it.